Welcome to Presidential Prayers. This is a series of our United States presidents and uh, prayers that they prayed themselves, perhaps a comment about prayer. And upon rare occasion, while we find no reference to a comment to prayer, that it might be in reference to the Word of God or the Lord Jesus Christ or God Almighty. Today, we're looking at Grover Cleveland. He was the 22nd and then the 24th president of the United States. And it's 1888, and he's making his Thanksgiving Day proclamation. In acknowledgment of all that God has done for us as a nation, and to the end that on an appointed day, the united prayers and praise of a grateful country may reach the throne of grace, I, Grover Cleveland, President of the United States, do hereby designate and set apart Thursday, the 29th day of November instant, as a day of thanksgiving and prayer to be kept and observed throughout the land. On that day, let all our people suspend their ordinary work and occupations and in their accustomed places of worship with prayer and songs of praise, render thanks to God for all his mercies, for the abundant harvests which have rewarded the toil of the husbandman during the year that has passed, and for the rich rewards that have followed the labors of our people in their shops and in their marts of trade and traffic. Let us give thanks for peace and for social order and contentment within our borders and for our advancement in all that adds to national greatness and mindful of the afflictive dispensation with which a portion of our land has been visited, let us, while we humble ourselves before the power of God, acknowledge his mercy in setting bounds to the deadly march of pestilence and let our hearts be chastened by sympathy with our fellow countrymen who have suffered and who mourn. And as we return thanks for all the blessings which we have received from the hands of our Heavenly Father, let us not forget that he has enjoined upon us charity. And on this day of thanksgiving, let us generously remember the poor and needy, so that our tribute of praise and gratitude may be acceptable in the sight of the Lord. Thank you for tuning in and listening to this video of Presidential Prayers. And I would encourage you to visit uh, my playlist where you'll find the previous presidents. And we are doing and working towards the present, uh, hopefully each week. Then we'll go back and find more that they've prayed about. But may God bless you. And uh, may God bless the United States of America.